Jaren and Mark here from Blade HQ. We're in the studio today and we've got something special planned. We have for you an automatic speed comparison test. Just not with that knife. Yeah, sorry. We've got 12 automatics and eight OTFs. We're gonna fire them randomly in groups of four and see how fast they go. Now we recognize our test is not gonna be 100% accurate as each knife has a different blade length, blade weight, as well as different firing mechanic. However, we made a selection of knives that have similar dimensions to make it a reasonably fair comparison. So the way this is going to work is we're going to shoot each knife in slow motion. We're going to shoot them at 480 frames per second. We're going to start the clock as soon as we visibly see that blade move, and we're going to finish it when it's fully deployed. We're going to count the frames in between and translate that into seconds. Now we want to be very clear that we're not saying that the fastest knife is the best, or even that one knife is better than another. We really just want to see how fast some of these knives fire. Let's get started. Let's do it. First up, automatics. CRKT, Elschwitz Anibus, HK Entourage, Hogue, EXAO3, Gerber, Covert. In Group 2, Smith & Wesson SW50TS, SOG Spec Elite 2, Microtech OSS Cobra, Piranha Amazon. In our last group, Protec Emerson CQC7, Shrade SC60B, Boker Kalashnikov, Benchmade Auto Spike. All right, let's go over these results. We put a graph together for you guys that goes over all the knives that we just tested. On the bottom we have all the knives listed in alphabetical order and the left side of the graph indicates how many frames it took the knife to deploy. Now let's take a look at what the frame rate means in seconds. This new chart shows the time with the side of the chart being a tenth of a second. As you saw in the graph, all these knives are really fast under a tenth of a second. Now it's time for the OTS. I bet these are gonna be a lot faster. We start off with Smith & Wesson SWOTF2. The Lightning, Lightning. Piranha, Excalibur, Benchmade, Infidel. In the final group, Shrade, Viper, H&K, Tumult, Asheville Steel, Paragon, Para XD, Microtech, Scarab, Executive. Now we have the same graph for the OTFs as we did for the automatics. Let's take a look. Again, brand names on the bottom and frames on the left. Now let's see it in seconds. As you saw, the OTFs were basically double the speed of the automatics. Well, we hope you guys had as much fun watching this video as we had making it. Um, leave some comments. Let us know if there was any results that surprised you. There's a couple knives that surprised us. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any of the Blade HQ action. We'll see you next week.